what CRM software is best for your business? Uh, CRM is customer relationship management platforms. And there's a software called Salesforce and another one called Thrive. And this is a Versa video. So which one is best for your business? I want to show you exactly from true customers what their opinions are. And I'm going to give you the price for Salesforce. And you'll see that compared to the price of Thrive in this overview. I'm going to show it to you. Let's ramp up. Now, going to this website here, the difference is the starting price for now these prices have been provided by the vendors and they've uploaded the information here. So the vendors of Salesforce said the price is $25 per month per user. And for Thrive, it says not provided by the vendor. Now, all right. So what is the price for Thrive software? I want to understand what I, I have a clear understanding what the price for Salesforce, but what is the price for Thrive and why they're showing it to me? So we'll, let's talk about that in a little bit and make sure if you want more information like this, these kind of versus videos of what software for your small business would be helpful. Go ahead and click the notification button, the like button, subscribe button. And if you do subscribe to the channel in the comment section below, just type I subscribe. That helps me get energized to keep on doing this type of stuff. But for you, you want to know Salesforce software versus Thrive. So let me make this a little bit bigger for you so you can see this. So the Salesforce software says that it is best for with Salesforce multi-tenant cloud computing model, we can serve the needs of companies of all sizes in any industry. Our customers benefit from a shared main framework while maintaining privacy. Okay, you got that. That's what it's best for. Now, hopefully that's very clear for you of what Salesforce CRM is best for if you're looking for this type of review. Now, what is Thrive software best for? What is this CRM best for? And I, I like to call this the Thrive platform more of a customer experience platform. So it says, they say, being a small business owner can be overwhelming. At Thrive, we created a simple software to help them get organized, communicate with their customers, and get paid so they can get back in control. Does that sound like you? Now, if you're looking for grant money, if you are looking for new grants to help your business grow and you just receive some of those uh, grant funds, from your local community, your SBAs, which one do you believe could be the best platform for you? Uh, well, let's continue to figure this thing out. So um, they, their product features, they have pretty much the same type of product features. And, but here's one of the main differences. The ideal company is for ideal number of users, two to 1,000 plus for Salesforce. And Thrive looks like they focus on a specific niche. So that's less than 50 employees or uh, 50 users. Uh, so that's a specific niche that they're looking at. And then ease of use. So that's what you want to understand. What is the ease of use when you're looking at a any type of software that manages your customer experience. Um, so in this CRM overview, I'm really going to focus on that ease of use. And for Salesforce, uh, this gentleman said that there is a bit of a learning curve as a lack of automation. Um, we have to manually change case statutes, which can be annoying and to click through the steps to do so. And another person would say, I love using Salesforce. It's very user friendly and helps me be able to stay uh, to track my progress and create a clean pipeline. Over here for Thrive, it's they say it's been user-friendly for all. Definitely will recommend to all business people looking to have better control over their business and schedule. I like I can send the reviews to customers. The phone calls are recorded and the customer portal. I've had one customer try out their portal and they loved it and found it very easy easy to use and that's key you want to make sure in any platform that your customers are are able to use it very easily so there's no friction with the customers um, let's go to let's scroll down here and see if there's anything else i want to share nope nothing here so let's go to another website that compares so pricing so the salesforce pricing so salesforce is this one here and they focus on the mid market so there's 
the micro businesses, small businesses, and then mid business and enterprise. And Salesforce, uh, 45% of the reviews came from the mid market, those medium sized businesses, 98% of those who gave reviews were for small businesses. And once again, we know the price per user is $25, but it goes up from there. So it's $25 per user per month for sales essentials edition, $75 per user per month for the professional edition, which most of you would use. And then there's a free trial. There's no free trial available for Thrive Software and they don't. they did not provide their pricing yet we continue to look for the pricing and figure out what that pricing is. So let's go ahead and figure out where can we find the price for Thrive software. And uh, let's see here, there's nothing else on this page about the price, but it does talk about the reviewer's company size. So in here you have small mid-market. So what is a small business? That's 50 employees, or less mid market 51 to 1000 employees and the enterprise is greater than 1000 employees so you can see who salesforce is pretty much good for and then the reviewers by industry so if you are in the computer software industry or the IT so information services information technology and services that's around 26% of the reviewers for Salesforce. If you look over at Thrive, you're looking at a lot of consumer services, 9.6% insurance, construction, uh, real estate. So those are the four industries that they really target that construction, insurance, consumer services. Um, then let's go, I found another site through G2. This is what I'm looking at now. So let's get a better breakdown of what this platform is so it's a top 50 enterprise products you see that right here and so it's just gives you a cleaner layout and i have all the links in the description section below and if you want to connect with myself or my team to figure out based upon what your needs are we can work with you on both of these platforms if you need but here's a good breakdown top industries represented computer software, information technology and services, internet. Now, if that's your business industry, then Salesforce might be a good fit for you. Um, ease of use, quality of support is always important. Ease of setting up, so that's very key as well. And then here's the customer reviews, like I told you that I'll show you. A must for customer-centric organizations, all right, and this is what I love about this website. It shows you what do you like best, what do you dislike. So you don't have to hear it from me. You hear it from people who are actually using the platforms and we can work with you to make sure you get the right ones for your business. So what do I dislike about Salesforce? It can be very complex and hard to find good help. So yeah, one thing I hear about Salesforce is that you need to most likely have a Salesforce consultant or engineer just to make sure that it works well for you. Finding good help that knows what they're doing in your initial setup is probably the most important task you have ahead of you if you aim to use Salesforce Service Cloud. Find a Salesforce certified partner for, for the best luck in finding good help. Utilizing the various Salesforce resources at your disposal can also help in implementing Salesforce correctly the first time. And that's what you want to be able to do with Salesforce is do it right the first time. What did this person like the best? It's absolutely the 360 degree view of customers and how many offerings Salesforce has to better interface with your customers. We were able to keep a consistent picture of our customers while offering consistent experience across the different disciplines of our organization, sales, service, and marketing. So that's what they're focused on. So that was a really good. And so let's go to the next one. So Thrive. So I found this article from Thrive and it looks like they won a lot of awards from also uh, Shelly Terry, posted this on um, October 1st. And so leader in a small business uh, for fall of 2020, 
momentum leader, um, users most likely to recommend, easiest setup, fall 2020, best um, estimated ROI, if, that's if ROI is important to you. So this is the recommendations and the awards that they receive from G2 crowd based upon specific users survey. So let's go to, this is great that they put this out for this report. But let's go ahead and let's the MarTech Breakthrough Award they won here recently for the 2020 Best CRM Solution for Small Business, uh, Small and Medium Businesses. So we know specifically who the Thrive Software is really focusing on, that 50 employer or less. So in so right here it says so going back to G2 Crowd Leader Fall 2020, and so. Let's go into industry. So construction, construction, consumer services, um, insurance, automotive, then other that is who made the reviews. Quality of support. Support is really is really key. Ease of setup is important. And then let's go to the reviews here. Here we go. Here we go. All right, so September 2nd, 2020, very complete tool with many functions in a single platform. What do you dislike? It's a very friendly tool. Every time I have a problem, I have peace of mind that the platform offers me excellent technical support that is always up to the problem. They are very efficient and capable of solving any problem or clarifying any doubts, okay? That's that's what do you dislike, all right? So, what do you like best? It's a very good tool for business. It's excellent for customer service. It always is ready to help. It offers a lot of customer support. I can keep track of all my new and existing customers in one place. It also has a great social media publishing platform. CRM tools are also very helpful. It is a complete and offers many tools in a single platform. So uh, that's key. And let's try another one here. Uh, let's see here. So this was July 21st. Is there any new ones? Nothing. Let me read this one here. Slow down. All right. So what do you dislike? Not much. Uh, occasionally there are a few glitches, but they are easily overcome. I look forward to seeing how Thrive tools will modernize and become more easily implemented in the future. What do you like best? The CRM tools have been phenomenal. I always I'm looking for a way to compete with larger companies. These tools allow me to do this. It's phenomenal. I'm looking forward to the new additions to Thrive. And uh, all right, so then uh, anything else to figure out from a dislike? And I don't see too much on the dislike section. So that's what I'm looking for for you. So, all right, this might be one. Executive sponsor and facility services, small business fishing cars. All right, so um, what do you like the best? It is, so the integration is cr of critical small business tasks from a CRM to marketing efforts to invoicing is excellent. So this platform has the invoicing built into it and also the scheduling. What do you dislike? I wish there were more fields that could customize, that could be customization for unique industries. I wish I could track pesticide usage on my appointments per government mandates, but only select a few businesses using Thrive would ever need this functionality. Hence, it would be a nice to have some customization fields. And then they did respond. All right, so what they say? Um, so Gabe Vasquez of Thrive stated, um, hello, and thank you for your review. Good news, our CRM software does come with customizable fields to fit your unique needs and then he provided an article and then he provided help so i guess it does do what that gentleman talked about so that's great so um this is just a, a i just want to do a quick and pricing let's go ahead and see if we have pricing over here so no pricing uh, get a, a quote for the pricing and so one of the reasons why is because i it's because thrive packages and customizes the packages for those small businesses and they do a great job in doing it and um, one of the things that you can do with them is bundle things together and so my 
team can help you bundle the Thrive platform and the Salesforce platform together with different packages to help you lower your overall cost and reach more customers. So that's one of the key things that you want to do, especially nowadays, is to be able to focus on, hey, there's ways to compare the different platforms, the CRM platforms, the different software platforms we need and, and finding out which one that is best for you and your employees without talking directly to a salesperson, you can utilize these tools and then follow up with a, a salesperson or follow up with a technical advisor like myself who works with these companies to make sure that you're, you're utilizing the right platform for not just your needs, but for your business and your employees needs. What is that best customer fit? And as a technology advisor, my team and I, we are like, what's best for the business? So we don't sell just one platform. We look at what is the best for your overall business. And in the description section below, you can go ahead and schedule a meeting with us and we can provide you that one-on-one -on -one consultation to figure out what's best for you. If you want to schedule that, um, that's available to you. Well, my name is Kendall Matthews. Hopefully this Thrive verse. Salesforce review was helpful for you. Go ahead and click the like button if this was helpful. Also subscribe and make sure that you tell other individuals that, hey, if you want to see a, another software comparison, put it in the comment section below and I'll put that on the list for comparisons. Hopefully this is best for you and continue to make sure to check out any of those grants that are available to help your business grow. My name is Kendall Matthews and let's continue to ramp up.